some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Los Angeles, California with dumbass Elmo and his little girlfriend, Liberty Lynn's audits as they attempt to ruin somebody's life who was just trying to do their job. And dumbass Elmo is definitely proud of that fact that he managed to pull that off. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this freaking S show on the road. Can I have your name, please? What's your position here, man? Don't play with me. Target acquired. Yeah, unfortunately, this is the guy that dumbass Elmo ends up targeting and ends up getting uh, hauled away, but fortunately not in handcuffs. What? Oh, no, they've got Thank you, sir. And of course, that's dumbass Elmo's uh, newest girlfriend, and Liberty Lynn's audits there in the background. And apparently, this guy knows his way around a jail cell or two. Which is, of course, why he hangs around a scumbag like dumbass Elmo. I do think that these two make a cute couple, don't you? That is the funniest. That is the funniest thing I've ever heard on radio. What do you think about that, Mister? Do you believe she's trying to get us in trouble for filming? Is it illegal to film in California? Hey, California. Hey, hey! You attack me. You assault him. You did that on purpose. There's video. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Dumbass Elmo, you are so damn pathetic. Now it's hard to tell from this particular angle if you walked into him or he walked into you. But come on now, dumbass. This is going a bit overboard. Getting this man arrested over that. I mean, that is just ridiculous. But you know what? This is just going to fit right into your victim complex narrative that you like to play on your YouTube channel. Yeah. Oh, poor little dumbass Elmo got bumped into by somebody. Did it hurt? This guy physically touched me. I want to press charges on him. Could check out the cameras. He did it on purpose. It's on video. Check out the video. He bumped into me on purpose. It's on video. It's on video. You did it on video, so it's on video. So I want to do the proper the proper investigation for that. Yeah, he did that on purpose. Yeah, yeah, we all know you want the police to show up and soothe your hurt feelings. So let's jump to that point, shall we? Many, many minutes later. Yeah. Hello, officers. Hi, how's it going? Give me a favor, wait over here, please. Am I being detained? No, but I'm asking you to give us some space. So we well, can you work. can you can have some space. I'm not interfering. Sir, listen to the order. And you and you are? I'm Sergeant Ponce, sir. Sergeant Ponce, I'm the victim here. Please don't don't tell me what to do. Oh yeah, you're right. You are a victim. You are a professional victim. You are a victim everywhere you go because. Well, trouble seems to follow you every step of the way. So much so that I've included one of your now more famous fails in my uh, outro. We'll 
see about that. I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you give you some time, and I'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt to see if. Why are you so confrontational? Because I just got assaulted. Okay, so we'll find out what's going on, sir. We're trying to help you out. Awesome. I have everything on video. Okay. Let me know when when you're when you're ready to see the evidence. I'm Enrique. Nice to meet you. And you? Castellano. Castellano. And you, sir? Lombardo. Lombardo. So, I guess you said that there might have been a battery that happened or something like that. Do you have it on video? Can we review that? Uh, your sergeant just reviewed it. Well, Do you want to see it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I got. Okay. I, honestly, I wouldn't want him to go to jail, but I would want him to get cited for it, to so we can so he can go, so 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 that the the prosecutor could determine. Well, dumbass Elmo, I don't think that would be the wisest thing that could happen, considering that every time a frauditor's video gets entered into evidence, it usually goes wrong for them, considering that cameras don't lie, unlike frauditors. Oh, wait, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead and enter it into evidence. Let's go ahead and see your attempt at uh, getting this guy a criminal record blowing up in your face. Well, at this point, this person's in a private person's a, arrest. He's going to catch a train. He needs to go buy a that for that. And if he, he's not doing that, then he is considered loitering. He's not loitering. He's paying. He's working. He's working on a that's, store. That's not, that's the way that's it works. What do you mean that's not a... Yes, this is a public place. We it's have the right to... Private property, sir. It's 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 also gets so uh, public confused. public grants. It's, this place gets public access, grants. It has public access. Correct. And, the, and public funds. <laughs> okay. Yes, it's private. But they get hundreds of millions of dollars to, to continue uh, this operation. You know, I've asked over and over again for a citation on this, uh, well... This idea that a piece of private property suddenly loses its right to trespass people off of it when they receive government funding. Because, you know, even on government property, you can be trespassed. So, dumbass Elmo, I challenge you to provide us with a citation that shows that you are in the right here, that... They can't trespass him for loitering and everything like that. I want to get the paperwork to okay, hey, process you, that guy. You want a report taken? I, I want to do the private person's arrest on him. So speaking with my supervisor, uh, what we could do for you is take a report. Okay, we give you the incident number and do all that stuff. So I can't, I and thought... And eventually, that'll get up to the detective. The detective will contact you. Go why, why, why don't you want him to get in trouble? I mean, I'm being lenient. Why can't you? Why can't? Why can't you do the right thing? I said I don't want him to be in jail, but he needs to be held accountable. There's no such incident, bro. He broke the law. That's the right thing, sir. That's not the right thing. If you break the law, the right sir, thing is to hold you accountable sir, are for you it. Listen or are you, are you going to listen? Me? Because I'm the one, I'm the victim here, and I'm telling you to do your job. I'm not asking you for anything special here, sir. I'm telling you, there's no problem, <laughs> cause. You There's, got in his face. I didn't get in nobody's face. Yes. Oh, you want to accuse me now? Oh, I see how this is going. This is going another route now. Let me guess. You're going to kick us out now. Is that where we're going now? I'm now we can't I'm be not here? I'm going to talk to you anymore, sir. Well, you're, 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 you're just not listening. Of course not. You're, you're, you're talking nonsense. I just got assaulted. Okay. How am I being confrontational? If we I was confrontational, taking, I would have defended. We are taking a report for you, sir. Anything else? Well, do the report. Okay, that's that's good. Do you have your ID? Can I? Can, the, did you take his ID? Um, you're the I'm the victim. I'm the victim. I'm asking you for your ID so I can get your information for the did report. Did you get his ID though? I will go talk to him right now. Oh, I'm the victim, so I don't have to identify myself. Is that what you're saying, dumbass Elmo? Gee, I wonder what they would find if they actually did ID you. But we all know that dumbass Elmo is a troublemaking moron with a rather extensive criminal history. But do these guys know it? Probably not until they get the ID. A little longer than a few minutes later. Loitering. Loitering is standing around without a purpose. We're actually... No. no we're working. No, no. Okay. We're working. Like, like he said, if he's looking, then he's looking. There can be an investigation. You're not... Him, listen, ma'am. Yeah, to us, he's standing around. Ma'am, ma'am. Ma that, that's why... Right? You're not comprehending that these videos are being published and this is a job? And he's at okay, work. Okay, it could be your job, but right now this is public, it's public not property. Correct. That's right? the what. That's but, the reason we're like here. I said, public property to access trains, not to just hang around. We, c if we're public. working for news purposes, we have the right to be here. Look at the policy. At Look at the policy. Look at the policy. The First Amendment doesn't have a time, Miss. Ma'am. Okay. Ma'am. You really, you really think 
social media is not a job. Oh, dumbass Elmo, that's not what she meant. Social media is a job, but generally a lot of people in social media don't go around antagonizing people to start a confrontation to get clicks and views. There are a lot of social media channels out there that make big money without antagonizing everybody in sight. Five minutes later. They're going to they're going to proceed with that. Here, just go over here to the table so I can wear All right. Private person's arrest, usually what happens after this is that the person, you're placing them under arrest for whatever it is, right? Can I take them in my own car? Obviously not. Ah, okay. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Go ahead. And essentially, you're placing them under arrest and we're just transporting him to the jail or uh, releasing him depending on what his uh, criminal history is with a ticket and a court date. Okay. okay? So it just depends on what his uh, criminal history is. And then uh, after that, someone will be in contact with you throughout the investigation. It's not going to be us because we don't do detective work. We just handle the initial investigation. 4741. Um, did you guys, do you guys uh, need me to send you the video or do you guys already have the video from here? We, oh, we video got it. From here. We got you got it? it? Yeah. All right. Awesome. Oh, one last question, officers. Um, can we have your blood sample so we can clone you guys? You guys are pretty awesome. We oh, need more shit. officers. Oh, shit. They like took him? Oh, go, go film. Go film. Go film. Go, 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 go. Okay. All right. Well, thank you. That would be it, right? That's it. All right. Well, thank you guys. I appreciate it. You take right. care. Holy cow. They just took this guy. They didn't handcuff him, but they're taking him to the police department. And this is where I'm going to end the video right here, folks, because, you know, dumbass Elmo just follows the guy out of the building and everything like that. He's not handcuffed. They're just escorting him to the police department. And that's really about it. Let's just hope that the prosecutor takes a look at the video and says, nope, we're not going to go forward with this because, you know, dumbass Elmo, well, he was the antagonist in this particular situation. But in California, you never really know. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. Go to jail. For what? You read Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? <laughs>